Well, they did it. They finally did it. Hello and welcome to Graham Snackers. I'm here to try a new flavor of Doritos that's a little surprising that it's a new flavor. I feel like, uh, I feel like this is something we should have seen a, a while ago, uh, but it does seem like the natural progression of these uh, ranch flavors of Doritos that um, Frito-Lay has sort of been experimenting with because we have, of course, the uh, we had the spicy ranch with the 3D Doritos, and then they came out with those tangy ranch Doritos, which I reviewed that uh, weren't good. So I'm guessing they're going for something a little reminiscent of like a buffalo ranch, which actually concerns me just a little bit because my favorite Dorito of all time are the Buffalo Blazin Ranch Doritos, which uh, apparently they still make, I think. They're still listed on their website as like an official product. Uh, and like the locator can't find any near me, but a couple of months ago, I found some in a gas station just randomly. And I was like, oh my gosh, I assumed these were discontinued because I hadn't seen them for so long. And I bought them and ate them and they were still delicious. And uh, even now, if I go back to that same gas station, which I have uh, gone there exclusively to look for those Doritos. So this inclusion now of Flaming Hot Cool Ranch Doritos sort of makes me think like, that flavor is just dead, not even randomly appearing at a gas station. Like, I, I should just give up hope on seeing it again. But hey, if these are good, then uh, maybe it's a fine replacement. Mm. It smells good. The smell does actually remind me of the Buffalo Blazing uh, Ranch Doritos. You can smell the ranch and the spice. They don't look quite as red as a normal Flaming Hot Dorito, which uh, I'm sure it's good because those are a little too spicy, so hopefully that uh, this ranch will even things out. My first gut reaction is that they just rebranded those buff Buffalo Ranch Doritos. Like, this is a very similar taste, but letting the flavor sit around on my tongue for a little bit, uh, it's clear that these are spicier. Like, these definitely pack a bigger heat than the Buffalo Ranch Doritos did. It's got that strong ranch flavor. Um, and I do think, yeah, the spice, it's not the same flavor as the buffalo, but it's very similar and it's definitely spicier. <laughs> I forgot to get water and these things just gave me the hiccups. <laughs> so that's a real spice. <laughs> well, the flavor is still very similar to that buffalo ranch. I do think that I preferred those. I think it was just a little bit better of a spice level. Now I do like when a chip sort of makes you stop and wait to eat more. Like, cause I do, I, I do have a chip addiction where I will, I will crush a bag. So I still really like the spice level. But no, I like it as like my favorite with the Buffalo Ranch chips. They were perfect spice level. They had more of a Buffalo flavor than just the flaming hot flavor. So those are still number one, but I can see why like those chips and these chips don't need to coexist because they are super similar. Because nothing on here says it's limited time. And this seems like a flavor they would want to keep around. It just seems like a no brainer of a flavor that they should have made, you know, years ago. So I rate these a great, like it's definitely a top tier Dorito flavor. My only problem with it is that it is, means that I'm less likely to see my actual favorite, which is only a little different, but a little difference can make a big difference. <laughs> So uh, if you get these, be prepared for um, like a serious level of spice, uh, definitely more so than the spicy nacho. Those are a very tame level of spice, but this is, this is probably not as hot as the Flaming Hot Dorito, but it's in the similar territory. Yeah, good stuff.